Well hello and welcome to another World of Warplanes video and um, in this one I think we're just going to fly about uh, the last two weeks we had some review videos so I'm going to do something different this week and um, today we're flying the uh, F4U and since I last flew this in a video I've upgraded the Let's go. Um, guns to the 420 mil um, guns and um, when I'd done this I'd noticed actually that um, the range and damage at range has changed um, so when you're firing an aircraft from a relative distance away it doesn't do that much because even it doesn't hit them because there's not enough bullets going out or it doesn't do that much damage because it's quite far away and the only time that you get um, tremendous amount of damage in airplanes is actually when you're up close and uh, well that's quite good when you're up close because you notice the difference but from a distance it's not that good so I'm um, debating whether to actually go back to my um, six machine guns instead um, so I'm not too sure about that yet and um, all the time to at the moment is to decide actually that what I should go for, where I should go for. I think I'm going to go for these two bombers over here, just this guy. Because everyone else is busy somewhere else, so it might give me a chance. Our headquarters is destroyed. Um, Inaccurate anti-aircraft fire. When I, uh, well, uh, the reason that I haven't really upgraded it the uh, aircraft a tremendous amount yet, because Hit. I've actually been away for two weeks, so I haven't been able to play with it. And I uh, come back and there's an update. And, um, so we've got some new things to update. When I was going and uh, one of them was that you can actually repair your engine. And that's the that's one down. Right, number three on the right hand of the screen. And uh, so I think, I think that's quite useful because some of these aeroplanes, as I say, we're flying them. But if the engine gets hit, that's kind of it. So I think that's going to be quite uh, a useful tool to have. I'm going to have to use it. Hit. But um, when I do, it'll be interesting to see what it happens. We actually have some ammunition as well, which is interesting. The weapons um, have one of the things we here was something like explosives, explosive rounds. And um, so I thought, oh, I'll put them on because I've absolutely no damage to ground planes. But I didn't try to get to the ground, I'm sure it does a bit of damage to the ground. And another one I was looking at, um, it Enemy was damage. on one of the Sherman bombers, was That's two um, down. an armor-piercing explosive round. So I've yet to find out what that's like. But I, think, I don't know whether that'll do any damage to airplanes or not. It'll probably be more for um, the ground targets, which I don't really go for. Because you seem to be a lot better off going for the airplanes and trying to take out the rest of the team. Last enemy. And, um, took a bit of a risk there actually to die trying to uh, take out uh, those two bombers over the um, over their base with their aircraft here and we only just about survived that maybe. Um, so it's always the best option but it seems it's actually paid off me taking out them two aircraft we really so that's good. Uh, two zero that's alright. I can live with that. Um, these new transactions where they got the unified account thing is quite cool. You just got to get those um, points up for playing the uh, World of Warplanes using World of Tanks as well. And uh, I can actually upgrade to the next um, engine now. And when I've upgraded to the um, when I've upgraded both engines, that's what I was going to say. I'll do a review of this aircraft, but uh, we've just upgraded this engine now, which was only 5,000 XP, which wasn't much. I was expecting it to be a little bit more, but we'll see how that goes. So, if you enjoyed uh, the video and uh, the gameplay, then thumbs it up and subscribe. And I think I'm thinking about actually going. Well, I haven't actually got that far. I've done a little bit of XP with the P51, but I'm thinking about going up with these uh, Yak-9 uh, that they released in the new update. So, I 
I'm, not, I'm torn whether to continue. I'm really pushing for XP on the P51, or to uh, go and do some of the Yak Nines. So, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, goodbye.